Hey, this is Mr. Mason Ed, and what we're going to do in this tutorial is practice finding the surface area of a triangular prism, which consists of two congruent triangles and three rectangular surfaces. Let's start by finding the area of our two triangular surfaces. So we can see that we have a right triangle here, and the base of this right triangle is 4, and its height is 3. And to find the area of any triangle, you multiply its base by its height, and then divide that product by 2. So 4 times 3 is 12, and half of 12 is 6. And because the other triangular surface is congruent to the first one, they are going to be equal in area. So if this one has an area of 6, that one has an area of 6. All right, let's find the area of this rectangular surface right here. Now the dimensions of this rectangle are 4 and 8. So if we multiply 4 by 8, that gives us an area of 32. Next, let's find the area of this rectangle right here. So the dimensions of this rectangle right here are 3 and 8. And 3 times 8 is 24. All right, we have one rectangle left, which is this one right here. And the dimensions of this rectangle are 8 by 5. And the product of 8 and 5 is 40. All right, now that we know the area of all five surfaces, let's go ahead and add them together to get our total surface area. So we have 6 plus 6, which is 12. And then we have to add 12 to 32, which is 44. And then 44 plus 24 more is 68. And 68 plus 40 more is 108. So the total surface area of this triangular prism is 108 square units. All right, I want to say thanks for checking out this video. Please don't forget to subscribe so you can be informed as I upload new tutorials that could help you with your math homework. 